Welcome to iSuite Biometry. This segment will illustrate the lens thickness measurements acquired using the LensStar. Lens thickness measurements are captured along the patient's visual axis, thus producing a highly accurate and reproducible measurement. LensStar utilizes optical low coherence reflectometry to measure lens thickness, which is a technology that is similar to time domain OCT. Each scan is composed of 16 individual measurements. These measurements are acquired using an 820 nanometer superluminescent diode. LensStar is the only optical biometer that is capable of capturing lens thickness measurements, an important data point for advanced IOL power calculation formulas such as the Holiday IOL Consultant and the Olson formula, and is especially important in IOL calculations for hyperopic eyes. This measurement precludes the need for a separate immersion ultrasound procedure and saves valuable time by streamlining your examination process. The measurement range for lens thickness is 0.5 millimeters to 6.5 millimeters. The individual lens thickness measurements are displayed on the results overview page. By selecting any of the lens thickness values, the physician can open a new window displaying all of the individual lens thickness measurements from the biometry acquisition. From this screen, the user may select individual measurements to evaluate independently. Measurement data can be excluded entirely by unchecking the box to the right of the measurements. The lens thickness values may also be excluded individually with a right click of the mouse. Excluded measurements will remain in the database and are not permanently deleted. To manually adjust the lens gates along the A-scan, it is strongly suggested that the user magnify the area intended for manual adjustment. To magnify, simply click on the magnifying glass icon. This will give the mouse cursor the appearance of horizontal arrows pointing left and right. Then simply left click and hold to highlight the area to be magnified. Letting go of the mouse button will enlarge the highlighted area. After magnification, the area displayed on the screen will only be the lens. The displayed crosshairs will mark the anterior surface of the lens as well as the posterior surface of the lens. To modify the lens gates, place the mouse cursor over the anterior lens gate. This will give the mouse cursor the four direction arrow appearance. Left click and hold to move the gate to the preferred location. Letting go of the mouse button will reposition the gate. To adjust the posterior lens gate, place the mouse cursor over the posterior lens gate. This will give the mouse cursor the four direction arrow appearance. Left click and hold to move the gate to the preferred location. Letting go of the mouse button will reposition the gate. The anterior lens gate should be located at the beginning of the first lens spike. The posterior lens gate should be located at the end of the last lens spike. Gates should not be adjusted along the same spike color as this could result in a false measurement. To exit the magnification screen, simply press the icon labeled 1 to 1. Adjusted results will have the notation of a hand pointing down. They will also be displayed with an asterisk on both the A-scan screen as well as the results overview page. Right and left eye measurements will open independently.